The road to recovery for surviving victims of the South by Southwest crash in Austin is as emotional as it is physical. We have introduced Hi, you before to 18-year-old Mason Endress, who was hit by the car at South by Southwest. Now nearly two months since the crash, she is constantly improving. KXAN's Angie Bevan met with her today and has her story. Is it good? Yeah. Multiple times a week. Three sets of 20. 18-year-old Mason Endress gets stronger. I'm on crutches, not a walker, and that's awesome. She works with trainers at Revis Rehab in Round Rock. Mason suffered a broken neck, nose, arm, and femur, and torn ligaments in her knees. Doctors told her her back didn't break from the car's impact thanks to scoliosis surgery she had years ago. So I have two rods and 24 screws that have corrected my spine. It's straight now, but it also probably saved my life. She still wears her South by Southwest wristband and now wears a new tattoo on that same wrist. The music note for South by kind of and my passion for music and then the angel wings for my guardian angel. Mason's parents attend her rehab sessions. Her loss of independence isn't easy. She doesn't want us doing things for her, but mom and dad, that's just what you do. Uh, I get told weekly, dad, I got it. Dad, I got it. High school graduation is less than a month away. Mason hopes to walk across the stage. If she's able, she'll do it. No doubt her attitude. One bad thing has led to so many good things. We'll see her through. I knew I was going to recover faster than they would really expect, and I plan on continuing to do that. <laughs> That was Angie Bevan reporting. Good for Mason. She's enrolled to go to the University of Texas this fall. Recovery following her two knee surgeries will be about three months each, and that could mean she has to wait a semester.